Hello everyone, this is Chesby17 and this is Time Splitters 2, so I finally decided to do something again with my YouTube channel because, well, I just feel it's right and I've just come back and I've got time so I thought I'll play a game. Uh, I know I've got Banjo, Kazooie I need to do and stuff like that, i got loads of stuff to do but in my own time, right? So I'll be doing this on and off for a while. I know it's Christmas and I bit work and get busy and all that, but what any free time I'll do this or play Skyrim, so yeah, so first level is Siberia. This is Time Splitters 2 on I'm on the GameCube, so hopefully it doesn't crash and yeah, let's do Siberia then. Uh yeah, we'll go for normal. Uh shall I read? No, I'm not gonna read. So I have this is a legendary game. This is like the first competitive like first person shooter game I've ever played like well not competitive online but with my mates and shit all through the years I don't know how old it is but it's a good really good game so let's go Nicola ah. shh, shh, shh. we shouldn't be in the research center without security clearance I'm telling you I heard gunshots they're killers if they find out. Come on, coward. Nikolai, the light! Stupid torch. Does nothing in this army work. <gasps> And kisses. Kabam. Control. Control. Come in. It's all down to me now. Okay, so... There's zombies, pretty much. So, as you can see, Sergeant Cortez jumped through the... Uh, what's it called? Time warp? I can't think what it's called. Something like that. So, the first thing you do whenever you start this game, preferences, and do that, because that just annoys me. Yeah. So... That's better. So, uh, Sergeant Cortez jumped through the thing, but it always changes changes him to a a person that is in this place at the same time as him. So he's just turned into some woman. I can't think of her name anymore. But yep. So we're going to find out and find the time crystals, pretty much. Same old, same old. Oh, bam! All right. So the best way to do this is just make sure all the cameras have been killed. It's not too. It's not too bad with the people. They're fairly easy. You just like. <laughs> Don't see me. I can't even see the line. There you go. So you just want to clear out this little facility slowly. And you don't get really. Don't want to get spotted because. Well, you can do. I'm sure I will in a second. So. Yeah, so this is a really good game, and this commentary is awkward because I haven't done it in so long. It's been months, so. Give me a break. Give me a break. There's a guy in here. Hello? Does this take some ammo? Okay, so. Um, can I see the objectives? Deactivate the communication stairs. Uh, investigate the digger side. Okay, so that's the communications disc up there, so we need to just clear out this place. If I can shoot. Like so. Oh no! Oh, yeah, there's a camera there. So you don't want to get spotted by them, because the alarm will go off and then you have a lot more fun and a lot more people. And if you do get spotted and you're here and you're like walking about doing your business, 
up there is where a sniper will appear if you ever get, keep getting shot at. Oh, hi. Hey, yo, camera. What are you looking at? Ooh. Alright, now I want to go get that guy who was walking about. Three bullets to the back? Come on, get over it. Okay, so this is where you open the door. It's down there. And then Okay, you want to follow along here. This I'm going to try and do the secondary objectives as well. There's time mines here, which is I think you only get 20. What? What? I just picked them up. Ah, there they are. Here we go. Here's the sniper guy. So he must appear when you pick up the mines. So, and there he is. So he gets annoying. Oh my god! Like that. I've got no ammo. So once you've killed him, you want to open these. Oh, I don't know if that works. You want to check the timelines there, next to the files, and that's one the sec secondary objective. There you go, one done. I think there's one in here. You want to just go like that, chuck one on there. Camera's dead. I think there might be one more in here. Oh no, sniper ammo. Uh, and you want to get the communications disc. This is the only way I've ever done it. You just look up here and chuck it over like that and then and then it should land over there like so okay so that's the first bit of this level done so we want to head inside this is the terminal uplink this is just like a little radar way I didn't click boys pools okay so no power store the power so steam, duck under it by pressing B or whatever bullet buttons you're using. There should be a guy here. Like so. And a camera. As you can see my shooting is great. There you go, that's better. So you want to slowly make your way up. Kill in the guys you come to. I think that's the last one for the stairs. Okay, there you go. So... Can't remember this. Oh yeah, I know this bit. So you want to get your sniper out with the ammo you got. You can take these guys out fairly easy. Oh, oh, sorry. Shot the door. Alright, fine. See you later. So body armor, and this is the gun you want. Good old Soviet. Get off me. From here I normally just go loud. Just, you know, kill everyone. No camping. And the jobs are good. And so you want to turn off all the steam pumps. Like so. I don't know. It's not really let's play. I'm doing like a walkthrough of this game. I don't know. Do that one as well. Then that one's done. And through the door we go. Uh, there's a camera somewhere in here. Oh no. I know on hard mode, in this room there will be a uh, some sort of machine gun turret thing, like a camera, but with like a machine gun, it's like doo -doo 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 -doo, and then it'll kill you, pretty much. But yeah. Huh? You need to watch out for that, but I'm not going to do hard because I don't want to be here raging too much. Take some ammo. Alright. Sick. Okay, so just go down these stairs, kill these people. It's fairly easy, this is the first level. It's fairly long first level though. So this is where I shot that camera out of when I was on the other side over there. Ooh. Oh yeah. And there's a sniper in there, like on the other side. You suck. Boom. Oh my god. So kill those guys. From here on out, I'm going to go loud and just kill everyone. Because it's more fun to watch someone running about, right? Okay. So there's a guy over here. And there's a, there's a Game Boy here. And got the... Uh, oh, fuck. That's a game cartridge. It's a game of Snake. 
and uh, you know snake for the good old Nokia's is a game like that and you can play it in here but I'm not going to there's a shower room in here if nothing in if you ever go on fire I think you can come here there is a point in this level where you come on fire and you need to get to water of course oh my god it's just spray Okay, so there's a, another book uh, thing in here, so chuck one in there. Awkward, awkward. There's a camera on that wall. See, if you look on the terminal at Blink, it tells you where cameras are. So... You can kill cameras with anything, really. It's a nice little melon. Got some soup. One fight. Didn't it do both? Oh, it's done them all now. So that's the secondary objective. So here we go. There's a guy that walks up here. You can do this bit silent, but I'm not a silent person. Take the fire extinguisher. If you ever go on fire, I think you might be able to put yourself out. Oh, oh, stop. No. So. Oh shit, what the fuck? Oh. No, I need all the help I can get, really. Okay, so here... When you've done all the secondary objectives, you can waste your time mines. There's some... See the miniguns things? They're the things that are planted everywhere on hard mode. So you can kill both of them. Are they dead? I think they're dead. I'll find out. Okay, so not fire extinguisher. I think they're dead. Yeah. Okay, so we want to get back out the this gun. There's the door. Okay, so we're going to need the system disc as it kind of hinted towards. So nothing in here other than those which are the undead the zombies. So we'll be meeting them soon. Okay, so there's a guy in this room. Hello! For good fun, you can always just go on this gun and kill him like that. You want to open both the doors. And this is where we're going to collect the system disc. So you get the shotgun from this. So, zombies. Lots of them. As soon as you get the system disc, they all come alive. So best way to do it. I think the door locks as well, yeah. So you want to come back to this alleyway, or this uh, hallway, and just slowly take them out one by one. It's fairly easy this bit, but if you're in the middle bit, there's a chance of them swarming you, and you know, you can't do anything. There you go. Okay, so, nearly there, nearly there. So back to the AK, Soviet, I think it's Soviet right, rifle in this game. So that's that. Oh, you can't turn the doors off. So, we got the system disc. So, do we have to go down here next? I can't really remember. So, this is where the two people in the cutscene died. They were checking down here, and there was a zombie down here, of course. So, we need to go put the system disc in, which is all the way back there. So, I will quickly jog back. Such beautiful music. It reminds me of James Bond. So you put the disc in. Now we're gonna have the time of our life. We want to take these guys out. There's the guys. The guys. They just spawn from everywhere. So you want to quickly run down here. This is the thing you got to kill. Put some time mines on that thing. I think that was enough. This is what I mean by getting trapped. Did I kill the container? Yeah. So. Okay. So you want to kill the container. You don't really need to worry about the zombies really. Kill him if you can. If you don't want to kill him, don't. So 
but now you got these uh, special forces coming, so and I've really wasted all my ammo. Oh, no scope. Oh, there's a mutant. Now, up here is the bit you need to be careful with. This is the guy. Do not get set on fire by this guy. Okay. Do n <laughs> no, no, I'm on fire! God's sake. So you can set everyone on fire. So you can go in here, I hope. There you go, and put, you put yourself out. Alright, so you want to try and just dodge everyone. Fire will kill him. Don't step in the fire, because fire hot and equals a lot of burning. So, but fire is a good way to combat um, yeah, the special forces, which is that guy just ran past me. Alright, see you later. I thought they attacked you, but maybe they don't. So I'm just going to slowly walk out like a good boy. Excuse me, sorry. Okay, so after collecting the time crystal and rebooting the system and killing the container, you want to slowly head up to the top floor. And now, as you can see, we activated the power. P -p -p power. So the elevator is open now. Like so. So you want to head upstairs, click the button, click this button. No, 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 no. <laughs> like so, and now we're heading up to the top. Third floor? No, 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 we want to go up. So you want to keep going up. I think that you can walk up, but real men take the elevator. Okay, so we're on top of the dam now. There's the sniper, this is the guy that's sniping us. And you want to get onto this gun? Oh, there you go. You want to take out this uh, chopper? Just by shooting it to death, and hopefully you don't die. Leave me alone! Leave me alone! Oh my god! Good. Is that guy shooting me? Okay, so the time portal is up, and. James Bond style, we're going to jump off the edge. No, we're not. And that's it. So that's the first level. So, success. So, how long did it take me? Not too long. So, that's the first level. And I will see you next time for part two, which is... Uh, Chicago, I believe. So, I'll see you then. Ciao.